Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Types of sampling. We have five different types of sampling that we'll be going over. First, simple random sampling. Second, convenience. Third, systematic. Fourth, stratified and clustered sampling. First off today, class, we will be going over simple random sampling. Now, in simple random, it's probably closest to cluster sampling, and we'll be talking about that later in the session. In simple random, you have an entire population. You start with an entire population. We're going to start with humans in a classroom. Each circle will represent a human. Now, here's a row of students in the classroom. There they are. They look nice. It is a random selection in which every student in this case, will have an equal chance of being selected, but they will be selected in subsets, like these two, and these two, and these two, something like that. They all had the same chance of being selected, but only six were the lucky ones to be selected. This is it. I hope you got the idea of simple random. And we'll be moving on. Moving on from simple random sampling, we will be talking about convenience sampling. As you all may know, Tyler Neal, who's a good friend of mine, lives on the same street as I do. You may say it's convenient to sample him. Well, that's what I'll be doing. I'm gonna go sample him right next door. Oh, these must be my Girl Scout cookies I ordered. Hi, Tyler. You're not a Girl Scout! Hey, Tyler, how's it going? Where are you come in, sir? Hey, neighbor. I was wondering. Wondering, eh? Um. I was wondering if. You would be part of my service. I would go to formal with you, yes. So, right now, we are going to talk about systematic sampling. Now, systematic sampling, I think, is actually pretty easy to understand. Let me just draw this out for you. Here, we have five males. So, in a systematic sampling, you would choose how often you select each type. So, just for kicks and giggles, we will be selecting every other one. You skip the first guy, we pick this guy, and skip this man, then go to the fourth one, and so on. We would skip him, and if I had a larger board, I would draw another one there. And I'd circle him. Systematic sampling. Stratified sampling. What can we say about stratified sampling, class? Exactly. In a stratified sample, you have a population. As you see here, we have four women and four men. But what we will do is split them with a line. At that point, once you split the population, by definition, stratification is the process of dividing members of the population into homogeneous subgroups before sampling. So after we've divided these homogeneous subgroups, then we begin to sample randomly, as we talked about earlier in this tutorial of statistics. I'm just going to close my eyes. I Circle that one, and I circle that one. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I'm going to circle this guy. I'm going to move over here and circle that one. Oh, okay, well, I circled three of the four men, but that's random. So, because I had no clue what was going on. A total selection of five members. And there you have it. That's stratified. That's it. Welcome. Again. The last thing we're going to learn is cluster sampling. In a cluster, we're going to use, say I'm doing a survey about how many times people shave in a month. We're going to use my neighborhood as an example. 
My neighborhood is a square, such as this. We will divide the population into clusters, like this. Now there are nine sections, or rather clusters, you know what I mean? There's, you will select a few clusters randomly, and you will survey each and every member in the cluster. So, I'm just gonna randomly pick maybe this area. Pick one more area. Look at that. Now we have three randomly selected areas. I will go survey each human in the cluster about how many times they shave in a month. That class is a wrap up on cluster sampling. If you can understand these five key sampling systems, which are important, then you will be a master sampler and statistician, but most of all, you will become a better human being. Peace on Earth, and enjoy the rest of your day.